Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, quite excited tonight because there should be a clear sky all night long and that hasn't happened for, for quite a long time. So if you have a look at the, the clear out side forecast in my location, you can see that it should be, should be clear all the way from sort of when it gets dark all the way through to the morning so like I say that hasn't happened for a long time well over a well over a, um, a month or so since I've had a clear clear night the whole night through so quite excited and hopefully should be able to get some some good data tonight going after the um, narrowband target of uh, the wizard nebula so I've not shot this target before so quite excited to collect some data on that and tonight I'm going to try and get the HA and the sulfur data so two filters tonight means I should have well I have to stay up and uh, focus halfway through or whenever I change the filter um, so it'll be a late night for me but hopefully I can get some some good data on this target um, just wanted to say thanks for everyone who's uh, commented or liked or subscribed to my channel I do really appreciate it um, like I said I'm quite new at this I only started this this year so um, really do appreciate your support also I'm having a little bit of an issue with the oxygen filter so I'm getting some massive halos um, on some of my images or especially with the oxygen filter I don't seem to have that issue with the HA or the sulfur so I'm not too sure what's causing it um, if any of you have got any tips, any advice about how to um, correct that in post-processing or something that I'm doing wrong, there's probably something glaringly obvious that I'm doing wrong that um, I should have a different gain or different exposure times for the O2 filters, but like I said, I'm quite new, so any advice I would really appreciate it. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for, for subscribing. Um, hopefully I should get some, some good data tonight and I'll show you at the end of the video. Okay, hi everyone. I've had a couple of uh, requests to talk about the gear that I use when taking these images, so just thought I'd take you through it now. I probably should have done this when it was a bit lighter because it's got, got quite dark as you can see, but um, I'll do my best to walk you through what I use. So my main camera that I use for all my narrowband imaging is the ASI 1600mm Pro, so that's a dedicated Astro camera with a cooling in the back so you can keep it nice and cool. Um, which helps to reduce the noise, which is uh, ideal for astrophotography. This is a mono camera, so obviously with a mono camera you need to use filters. So I've got the um, ZWA filter wheel here, and I um, mainly shoot that with uh, narrow band filters, so HA, O2, O3 and uh, S2 filters. So that's my main imaging camera and my filters. I uh, use the ASI Air Pro for my auto guiding um, which seems to work really well, I've been really impressed with it. I don't have any other experience with, uh, with PhD Guiding 2 or um, any other program so this is just all I know but I've been really impressed with, the, with how easy it is. Um, I have uh, the mini 30mm um, guide scope and the can see that the uh, ASI 120 mini uh, guide cam so quite a cheap guide cam and uh, scope but it seems to do quite a good job um, my mount um, I'm using the uh, Skywatcher NEQ6 mount which uh, as you can see is uh, is quite well loaded at the moment I've got three three of the counterweights on because of this big big scope that I use. So this is the Skywatcher 190 Mac Newton, the Skywatcher 190mm. So um, this is a thousand meter focal length, a uh, thousand millimeter focal length, sorry. Um, and I think it's f4.9, might be 5.6, I'll put that up on the screen now. Um, so it gathers quite a bit of light as well, quite fast. So yeah, that's my setup. Um, that's answered some of the questions.
okay so i didn't have uh, much luck the other night with the weather um i was shooting for about 45 minutes to an hour before the clouds rolled in forecast clear all night but <laughs> that's the uh, joys of uk astrophotography so anyway all set up and back to the uh, the wizard nebula mm -hmm. 